Henry and Mudge, story by Cynthia Ryland. The Green Time Beside Henry's house was a big green hill. Late on summer days, Henry and Mudge went to the top of the green hill. They looked down. They saw Henry's white house. They saw Henry's blue bike. They saw Henry's wooden swing. On top of the green hill, Henry felt big. He felt like a king. He saw his things below him, and he felt very big. I am king of the green hill, Henry said. He looked at Mudge. You are my dragon, Mudge wagged his tail. Your name, Henry said, is Fireball, Mudge wagged again. And you are very scary, Henry said. Mudge wagged some more. Henry and Mudge marched all over the top of the green hill. They met other kings who had dragons. They chased them away. They met monsters. Mudge ate them. They marched and marched till they could march no more. Then they found a magic tree on the green hill. It was a tree for kings and dragons who were tired. Henry and Mudge sat down under the tree. Henry put his arms around Mudge. They were glad for a magic tree. They closed their eyes. And a boy and a dog slept together on the green hill in their green time.